I'm going to start by putting uh, wood stain on all the plywood pieces. There's a couple of pieces that I don't need to stain. Uh, one is the latch spacer and the glue sticks. Don't need those, so I can just pop those out. Uh, we're not going to stain any of the, the centering rings, so leave those out. And then um, on this piece here with the uh, leg tips, it says the temporary spacer, no glue. Don't need to do that one either. Um, so you can pop that one out or leave it in and work around it. All right, everything else gets wood stain. Um, as I'm building this rocket, I'm going to be using, um, once you stain them, you'll notice you're not going to be able to see all the little uh, nomenclature on them for the part numbers. Um, so in, included in the kit is this printout um, that shows you all the part numbers so that we can, uh, when we start gluing it up, you'll grab the right piece. Because once they're black, they're really hard to see. Uh, the wood stain is pretty easy to use. You just paint it on with a paintbrush. Open the can. Just be very careful with this because it does get everywhere. Paintbrush. That's right here. You can see it's very liquidy. It's a little frothy because I uh, shook it up a little bit. Just put your paintbrush in there and just paint it on. Um, the only thing you need to do is try to do both sides at one time because you are adding um, liquid to the wood and it might warp the wood. So if you do both sides at the same time, um, there's less of a chance for it to warp. And you could put this on pretty thick if you want. Um, it's just going to soak in and then dry. Since it's water soluble, it'll dry like it was water. So anywhere, depending on your humidity level where you are, anywhere from an hour to, you know, three or four hours will be dry. If they fall out, it's okay, just paint them. Um, I'm not too concerned about the edges right now. We're going to get those um, after we glue everything together. Um, and then since both sides are wet, um, I just try to uh, stand them up so that air can get to both sides. Um, and that way they dry a little bit faster and they have a less tendency to warp. So I'm going to be doing this for the next few minutes.